I am at the moment feeling almost the same level of outrage and heartbreak that I was just feeling two or three months ago when my hometown Gaza was being bombed. I am so outraged and heartbroken for my Afghani brothers and sisters. I am in solidarity with the entire land of Afghanistan. They absolutely deserve full human rights. I just would like to say the United World was very thankful to whoever is participating in this event and came to show their support to the cause. Um, so thank you for coming, uh, because in the words of Malala Yousafzai, when the world goes silent, even one voice matters. Right, most of us are not from Afghanistan, and it's impossible to know how those who are from Afghanistan, those that are still in Afghanistan, Afghan Americans, and our students here in Oklahoma, how they must truly be feeling. But that's why it is so important for us to be here. Personally, I have a lot of friends who are in this situation, their families are in this situation, and they're trying to evacuate. Um, I believe they can help out the refugees that are fleeing, the, that are some of the lucky ones that are managing to flee the country right now. I think that would be the first step. And probably speak up about the uh, issue um, in platforms like the United Nations. I'm just so heartbroken. I see the images and the videos all the time and the helplessness that I feel is unbearable. I think of them as the same I think of my brothers and sisters and my parents and my uncle and aunts. It celebrates diversity um, and most importantly, um, it promotes peace and that is exactly why we all are here today. And again, we love you and we support you and we do believe that everybody back home in Afghanistan will sort of deserve full um, human rights access, full equality, full equity. They deserve to be treated the, like the humans they are.